Hello, ladies, gents, and witless spelunkers crushed into a pancake, back into the adventure mode. I must tell you, I must tell you, I'm recording all these in a batch again. I don't even like her. She looks like a dumbass. <laughs> Let's just go back. Recording all these in a batch, so uh, have not caught up to comments or nothing. Let's go back into the adventure mode with that brand new wonderful philosophy of maybe maybe not resort to violence at all times forever and just have a, a whole load of time of, of fun trying to get through the game in a reasonable manner and i believe already results were obtained in the previous episode not happy about this bite to the face but once again i just feel way more comfortable restarting right now because I hate the fact that I got down here without a, a rope and I don't want to work at it so just restart that and this is a much better start look at that look at that major stupid does get a little bit of damage and I do have to use a bomb but it doesn't matter because I grabbed the bomb back so good I'm sorry major stupid but you're the the victim of this particular narrative major stupid the third did not live on to have more descendants it's all right it's a very unlikely that it will be my last time through these caves a different incarnation of you shall survive there's a literal infinity of variations of your flesh i'm pretty broke and this bomb paste i'm a great proponent of this bomb paste i don't want to kill you i have established pretty clearly <laughs> I thought maybe I could get far enough. It's it's difficult to to get those st stealing interactions. To gauge, it's difficult to gauge just how far you can get before he starts shooting. Just uh, get through all this. You know, just throwing a few seeds away. It's all right. We're going to find the right one. There was a very easy damsel rescue there that was kind of dumb are they even called damsels anymore pretty sure now it's just pets i guess rescued the pet i don't know if there's an actual term rescue the animal helpless little cute woodland creature that's wor worship satan I mean, it's uh, all right to do this i my conscience is clear going for this key especially since it's so damn easy thing is We've been going through the jungle so many times and not once have I seen it like it may have blinked here or there. I haven't seen it. It just, I can't notice it. I must be some kind of idiot. Look, he has some, some really good stuff. Some really good stuff. Why don't you come over here? Like this, this guy's so easy to rob though. <laughs> I must... Rob him! If I run, he's going to shoot him. He's going to shoot me. Alright, fella. You you have sealed your fate. You have sealed your fate. I apologize. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> when your backpack sets your whip on fire, well, it does destroy packs. Wonderful. Easy health. Well, break even because the stupid mole, he was invisible, he was stealthed. He was actually, literally, wearing a stealth belt. And I was completely incapable of stopping him. Complete. Every time I forget the sheer size of these bombs and every time they come out is a wonderful surprise. Do you have a Gronk or do you have just riches? Or maybe just a pile of bones because you're a disturbing son of a bitch. Man, they are just nasty. Literal, little bones in his closet, this man has. Skeletons in his closet is the actual experience, uh, expression. Yeah! I don't know where you go, fella. I don't know why you exist. But I don't appreciate you. Should be safe to just ignore him. Except... Oh, he's used the exit guy, right? You did. Don't lizard me. 
I'm more powerful than you, stupid lizard. You can't stop me. You can't control me. I cannot be caged. I cannot be controlled. Party Moen always gets... Always gets kidnapped in that cutscene. It's just, just heartbreaking. Anyway, let's just go over there. How many of you are going to understand that reference? The further we get from the good old days, the less of you... Zoomers! No references to the gaming classics! That's not what I wanted. Take it easy. Take it easy. I know that if I throw a thing at him, he will roll. The thing is, he doesn't crush items. You can just drop that shotgun right there and go grab a skull. Kind of annoying. Do I have to do this? I'm gonna do it. Do, 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 do. It helps when you don't destroy the skulls, though. It is quite the boon. Volcana? Sure. Well, uh, uh, <laughs> just a moron. Look, I think everything can be summarized by. Oh, I see. Uh, you know, I thought that he was alright. But I get it now. Black is, is he's just a moron. He's <laughs> like, uh, can summarize every one of my problems. Oh, oh. He's just a moron. No! Could have been bad. He crushes enemies, does not crush items. Kind of weird, the distinction that they made. Maybe because they wanted for him to give you money. Now I know why I'm going out of my way to get the money. I'm a little sick of the jungle. Let's go to Volcana. I do think Volcana is the more challenging place. Purely. Purely. Oh, I wanted to kill that. I did not succeed. Uh, purely because of the lava exploding. Any any kind of explosion in lava is going to just wreck the entire level. It's going to make your life so much more difficult. Please don't get triggered so that I can come around. Pretty annoying here. I think it's worth it using this bomb. Grunk, you are a little too close there. <laughs> well, he just didn't know. He didn't know that the explosions are... Completely out of control. There we go. Explosions are completely out of control while I have this pack. Let's just hope that we find a shop with a whole bunch of bombs in it. That would be great. Uh, I do have rope, so I will spend one here. And also, just the drill is so much more challenging than just finding the City of Gold. Not the City of Gold, the Black Market. Because it forces you to go through all the lava nonsense. What the challenge. I don't want that guy to blow up because, again, with all the lava nonsense, it makes it a real pain in the butt. But I will spin a rope to have a amiable interaction with Gronk over here. He does get off my... See? He, he, he tries to flee. Sure, I'll use another. I am not afraid. He tries to flee my sacrifices, and they no longer count as full damsels. It's full, uh, you know, full, full point sacrifices. Nope. But here's one. Oh, Lava Boy. The Lava Blob trying to kill me. It should be safe. I do not see any pool of lava. Uh, what are you even uh, selling, fella? I don't want to shoot you. I would appreciate if you just come out of it. I wish that he were carrying bombs here. Yeah, I have to do that. So many ropes being spent. I do want that jetpack. Hey, he got out. He got out and he got out of my face. Still believe jetpack by far the most useful. Still. But it is a choice. It's a pretty interesting, fun choice. To have several things. You know what? I did not want those climbing gloves. Now that we have the jetpack, I would have been all over them with the with the power pack. And in fact, now that we have climbing gloves, I'm like, it is a valid choice now. To say, maybe you want the power pack now. Giant explosions. No recoil from this uh, shotgun. Let's go with it. Only for the fun of it. He did. 
just another maniac. That's right, no jetpack. <laughs> Easy to forget. He, he, he's waiting for me not to be alert to jump out of there. It's the way he does. I'm just going to go. I wanted to make a few more sacrifices. We maybe could have gone the Kapal out of this. Uh, moon challenge, hell yeah. Do, 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 do. Into the place we go. Okay, then. I honestly don't like the name Shamrock for that object. Object. I know that that's the name of it. It just sounds like such an inappropriate name for a four-leaf clover. It's like Shamrock is like a sex move. Shamrock is something you do when you hear a, a, a cool tune and you make a Shamrock move. Shamrock should not be a plant. Especially not a plant that looks so soft and, and friendly. Maybe a shamrock could be a very hostile looking thorn plant. I'm okay with that being a shamrock. But shamrock for a four leaf clover is just not appropriate. I don't like it. I don't endorse it. Right, let's go through all this nonsense. There might be another creek down there. No, just an ingot. Maybe there is something on the other end of this. Let's start digging. Yeah, 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 give me a crate. Yeah, yeah, nope. Yeah, crate it is. Nice. Now we'll get some more money. There might be more challenges going forward. There might be more fun times. With really... Admirable entrepreneurs trying to sell me skulls. And arrow shafts. Uh, why are you... Why are you drawing your bow? <laughs> it's just... What? Calm down, fella. Just calm your tits. We're all friends here. Just get rid of this nonsense. We're all friends here as long as, um, unless you have a bald pate and a mustache. We are all on the same team. I do not serve Hundun. Whatever the hell that may be. I don't know what that is. <laughs> and, uh, they mention it. Like, you must be a servant of Hundun. I'm not a servant of Hundun. I serve no one but myself. Is that another Kali Altar? Yeah. Only two bombs, though, so we actually had to work at this. Alright, let's do a bomb. Love! Almost got Lava Blob there. Uh, ooh! That's deadly. That's deadly for my friend. Oop. Careful. Huh? That was weird. Why didn't I try to tame him? Huh? Oh, I was just dropping uh, next to a different pixel. I guess that was bizarre. But right, now that uh, you are tamed, you can come in some sacrifice. Ooh, nice. Well, our health troubles don't make me catch fire. That would be very, very upsetting. Our health troubles are not solved. Thoroughly assuaged. There's a weirdo over there waiting for me. Only two bombs, unfortunately. Uh, getting a shot to get through here. Nearly impossible. Very annoying. I don't want to spend this bomb. Well, this guy's actually kind of hard. I mean, look at his pants. Whew, I just wanted to trigger him. And we're hoping that in the next... That crushed not just my head into tiny bits. That crushed my soul. <laughs> I was tunnel visioning with the shopkeeper. I was tunnel visioning with the shopkeeper and the pot, pot that spawned a spider. Did not even notice that. Even after he was dropping, I just didn't notice it. Until I was literally dead. <laughs> so, you know, not feeling too bad about it because it was all these horrible dangers. And there was one danger too many to deal with. That was my story in that one. Beautiful death, though. I am. Um, any kind of death that ends in a massive, world shattering explosion, I'm a proposed proponent of. So, I'm not even mad. Alright, friend. I'm going to buy a couple things and we're going to leave you alone. Look at me. Look at me. Letting go 
of all the violence in my heart. Here we go. All the terrible impulses, my urges, the dark passenger. You're not gonna win, dark passenger. You probably are gonna win, but I'm going to ignore you for a little while. I can pass up on the temptations that you drop into my head for a little while. Definitely worth a bomb here to get two points of health. Don't really care about keeping a mount. There you go. Get wrecked. Oh yeah, Margo was hungry. She just wolfed that down. Like it was so much cocaine. She eats cocaine. She doesn't... Like she wants to be a trendy California trendsetter kind of gal. But she doesn't understand the concept of it. She's been sheltered in these horrible caves all her life. So she doesn't understand just snort cocaine. She just eats it whenever she finds it. That dies. Gambling, you say? I have some money to let go of. I am a person of vices. And you're selling garbage. Hey, freaking moles! <laughs> Why do you have to be like that? Why do you have to be like that? Sure. I really do like the gambling booth, by the way. It's kind of annoying to be throwing these dice, but it is so profitable. You're nearly guaranteed to at the very least get money and just a bunch of free items. I mean, obviously. On average, I'm saying, ow. I don't know why I took that point of damage. It's bouncing to my head, I guess. On average, uh, this is supposed to be very, very profitable. Uh, the RNG, not perhaps the greatest I ever saw. Don't throw him up. Why, though? No! <laughs> Please, allow me to close doors behind me so that the dice don't just bounce out of the store. That is the stupidest way. I think that is literally the stupidest way to anger shopkeepers. It's like, I'm trying to play your dumbass. Yeah. Oh, too early. I'm trying to play your... Uh, play your dumbass gambling booth. I'm trying to win prices for legal means. Look. It may be slightly immoral, but it's, it's legal. So, angry shopkeepers in such a silly manner. I'm trying to find something to trigger this arrow trap. I don't want to spend a thing, but I'm gonna have to. There was a mole. Let me just violently use you, mole. What a wonderful conclusion to our story. <laughs> You know something that I really don't like is this. It's like, why, why did they include this? I don't know. Like, this kind of triggers arrow traps if you have the space. Please. But it gets me damaged and doing things that I don't want to do way too often. And I'm going to blame it for my shortcomings instead of actually taking, taking ownership of my stupidity. All right, uh, we're, we're losing the plot here. We made it two places, and that is just the second biome. And somehow that still feels like an accomplishment. But please, please, it's time to actually get some good stuff done. Oh, I'm broke, huh? I'm broke like your mama. Extremely broke. Um, I, mean, I do want these items. I'm not willing to pay for them because I can't. Do you take turkeys as payment? That would be useful. Maybe this guy can give us some good stuff. Again, like I said, I am greatly fond. Come on, you can do it. Greatly fond of letting go of that routine of Murdering shopkeepers. If only for the novelty of it. Should tell you a little bit of my tendencies when it's a novelty. Do not resort to violence right away, but there it is. It's the truth. Also resent very much. Giant super snakes coming out of pots like that. I hate this. I hate this. Oh, there goes the turkey. Ha <sighs> <sighs>
<laughs> you know what gets me with the bear traps every time is that slight lightly this lightly pressing the button doesn't get you to the ledge so you need to actively press it down long enough to get to the ledge and that's what gets me every time i try to quickly get to the ledge and it prevents me that happened See, see, uh, that's what happens. Like, I'm obviously not shifting blame, trying to explain what's happening and why I actually suffer damage from something that really shouldn't be getting me at any point. It's because my button press not long enough. You're gonna trip again? No, instead you're going to be a major pain in my asshole. Look, uh, it's not my fault. It's not my fault. He puts himself in these situations, okay? The joke's on you. I have a freaking shield. I mean, this will protect me forever. Nothing will come to destroy me now. All right. I'm going to keep the shield because it's hilarious. Even though my survivability is probably going to drop a great deal. I'm still a proponent. Of, uh, you know, making a little bit of variety. Because it really gets old. It gets old to have the shotgun all the time. I think I value the variety that comes from foregoing it more than I do. Alright, I wanted to check does this shield protect me from that? And the shield is just all powerful. Incredible. I'm sorry, Major. I mean, not Major Stupid, but. Well, it does have a slight, slight weakness on the top. Does not protect you from all sides. There's another shop right here, and it is a glorious one. Don't shoot, though. I think if I throw a bone like so. Oh, I pissed off Antonio Banderas. So that's all right. He immediately drops the... It's funny how he immediately drops the key. It's like, he gets angry. And he's like, drop all the keys. Maybe this will save my life. You fool. <laughs> you have been murdered by your own buddy. We'll play together. You're only in cahoots against me. I know it. Okay, friendo, can you maybe... Oh, he dropped all the way down, huh? Well, you guys can entertain yourselves however you like. I'm here helping myself to all of your stuff. And now I am super bomb rich. Definitely doing that. Getting that extra health. Nice. Look, it took a little bit of work. Took some silly attempts and some nonsense. Giantest bomb ever conceived. This goes to a place where I don't want to be, does it? Actually, that's fine. <laughs> but, you know, it was an intimidating situation with all these shopkeepers all over the place give me a Kali altar and we'll be golden but no no Kali altar unfortunately all right i guess we're leaving let's stop memeing with the shield this one's at an extremely fruitful level let's not be idiotic anymore there's a more man i have the skeleton key i'm going to continue purposefully ignoring it okay just to drive you nuts just to keep getting the, that engagement through frustration. But do you think I just ignore the fact that I have a skeleton key on my inventory? No. I'm just ignoring it on purpose to drive you insane. And make you comment. And that gives me my, more algorithms. I am collecting algorithms. Anyway, the guy opened the thing. And now... I mean, it was, it's nice when he opens the whole, the whole uh, area. And I would like to help myself to his wares. All right. And we have a billion bombs. Volcano or the other place? I have no boots. But I also have no navigational items. Let's go Volcano. Seems to be the trend for today. Uh, no boots makes the jungle quite a bit more challenging. I like this method of going through here. I mean, not like it matters. I can just blow my 
way in to that area from this side, the pods are going to get me every damn time. It's just idiotic, the amount of damage I take from enemies. They're going through the pods. There might be a Cali Alta right as we round the corner, so let's get Gronk out of there for a future sacrifice. Might as well get a double Gronk. Gronk Anuk Dug. Well, the former killed the latter for no fault of my own. Okay, Ugduk, let's see if we can make something happen with you instead of just dying instantly, okay? Blah, blah, blah. Kill the filth. What you got down there? Nothing terrible. Ooh! Okay, Ugduk, I believe, has become a crispy little meatball. Hilarious. Why is the no shot keeper here? When the lava's gonna drop, bad things will happen. I would like Major Stupid to be saved though. But he's gonna shoot at me. The lava will drop. Let's just go. <laughs> like, why give myself the vari the variation? All the variables that come through this. Instead of simply going. Get through the exit. There's two exits here. Is this the drill area? How did, how, I do have the Ujarai. A little bit of a challenge. Let me go through this side. Ah, only three ropes, unfortunately. I'll put a bomb there. I don't want to use my rope. Should be able to make a stair. With the shotgun jump. All right. That happens. There's the drill. It was a, a challenge to get in there. Filthy. Ladybugs! This drill must be activated. Vlad must be disturbed. That happens. Alrighty. I mean, it doesn't matter. That guy. Can I make it up there? No, I'm gonna have to. I guess I'll just want my second to last rope. Down it goes! Please, no lava in the middle. Probably there's going to be lava in the middle. It's all, there always is, right? There's like a no chance of getting no lava. I didn't know that happened. If you destroy the chains, they become uh, flying enemies. Fascinating. Well, that bat did not enjoy his last moments on Earth. They'll tell you what. It's a clean burning volcano. I'll tell you what. Uh, sure, keep her man. The most graceful. Please don't. <laughs> you don't actually want to drop this, though. I don't think. It'll drop somewhere inconvenient. Oh, he he's stuck. Can he get... What is this? Oh, this is the exit. I'm, <laughs> I'm like, why is there a, a, an exit here? The level continues so much further down. I'm seeing you, you son of a bitch. A few bombs until he starts being a problem. <laughs> oh, wow. That was extremely upsetting. Thankfully, we worked it out. Alrighty. No lava somehow. I don't think I've ever seen that. Uh, it'll continue killing me. It'll continue killing me for probably the next year or so. The fact that recoil gets you off chains <laughs> and, and vines, it will keep killing me for a good year until I finally get used to the idea, hey, don't shoot from ropes and vines and, and chains because it kills you now if uh, there is anything deadly below you. I'm uh, going to chalk that up to my extensive HD training and not being idiot, an idiot. And uh, you can you can possibly not ever disagree with my assessment. You can't. You're not allowed. I really do want these boots, though. Like, boots are so damn important in Spelunky, too. Uh, but I'm not going to be able to do it. Who Jedi is here, huh? Well, like I said, you know what? And you know also what killed me there? Just trying to be fancy. Just trying to be fancy. Going places. It's like just... Get through the gate. 
Forget about the Ujarai. Forget about all the extras. Let's go through the game. And obviously, it's a lot of fun to go through all the extra levels and all that stuff, so that's why you do it. Uh, sure, there's probably ropes in here, so it's okay. Get back up. Yeah, why not? Why not keep from Major Stupid? Like he's so much garbage. Please don't kill him though. That is be very detrimental to my interests. Off we go. 1 4 already. Just speed running through this nonsense. We're going to get back to where we're at. If you don't try to be fancy in Volcana, you don't have to work so hard at it. I do want to go to Volcana though, because that seems to be the philosophy these days. I seem to just decide to do that. Probably should have destroyed all the skulls to see if we can go, if we can get that skeleton key, but eh, whatever. Let's just get through all this silliness. I have specs, that's about it. Darkness. My old friend is no longer a big problem. Uh, sure. For the same rationale as before, we'll carry a Gronk with us. Maybe we'll find Ugdug and Unger as we go forward. They will be extremely helpful. I think the drill is here. Whenever I see the... No, it's not. Wow, what a horrendous trap over here. They don't get aggressive, right? You just walk past them and they don't give a damn. Robots. They're peaceful individuals. Ow. Look. That was a tough little devil. I don't know why I took damage there when I, you know, I clearly whipped him. But I'll, I, I embrace it. Gronk is very, very uh, nimble. Can I please... Okay, Gronk. Grunk, go ahead and scout ahead. Can I please get a store where I don't throw these dice? Where they don't belong. Wow. <laughs> Uh, perhaps not the greatest uh, RNG of all time. This boomerang, though. I would appreciate it, it going to my inventory because that's how far we have fallen. Give me a three. No three. That's how far we've fallen. I am coveting a boomerang. That's my current mindset. Please. Last attempt. A five is good. <laughs> well, I went completely broke playing the no-brainer gambling booth. It ain't right. Okay, so you, you guys do get a little aggressive. Not a lot. Don't destroy the lava, please. All right. Oh. Just a secret door for no reason. What you got? Bunch of money and a key that does absolutely nothing for me. Alrighty, I think we saw the key early, uh, the the hiding spot earlier. Why is that a secret? Makes no sense. Please, nope, no, I cannot land on anything. I am uh, completely useless when it comes to landing on dogs. Holy crap, brother! Damn, and that is the spots where. I can just uh, blame the controller for her. Like, I can safely say, yeah, that's just me being absolutely idiotic controller-wise. Uh, the fine controller is just not in my thumb. It's not in my thumb. It's not my fault. Look, there is a beautiful crate that I was tunnel visioning to. You can't blame me for being idiotic. You can't do it. I'm just going forward and just getting a, an arrow trapped to the head. Callie is here. And with Cali, honestly, Cali uh, and the Kapala have become so much less valuable since there's so many insta death ways of dying. And not just insta death, but stun lock deaths. This is gonna drop into the spikes, huh? Yep, straight into the spikes. Please continue dropping. Watch it back. I want to grab you! <laughs> there we go. Ah, uh, a jetpack, you say. Get a 
gift from the goddess. I want to kill this man and sacrifice his body to to her and holiness. Can we go down there. Take this jetpack. Quickly jump jump out of there. Perfectly reasonable way of behaving here. Mr. Antonio, do I want to just uh, try to do murder upon you or do I just want to leave? What the hell just happened? Oh, I bet a power pack just <laughs> exploded. <laughs> you moron! You were supposed to survive. Trying to find a damsel. Fortunately. Unfortunately, no damsels here, but now we can go to Antonio and just kill him dead. I think I'm going to commit to all of these sacrifices. Wonder uh, where the damsel spawned. Maybe at the very beginning I missed him. But the pictures miss not the greatest. The greatest gift of all time. You could have maybe wrapped a turd in a present box and I would be more happy than getting the freaking pitcher's mitt. But I'll embrace it. Okay, so. Just killed you dead, almost messed it up. Something about. Something about shooting him in the face. So it's not that trippy. It's hard to stay where I want to be. Let's see if we can get that live turkey over there. And uh, we're pretty much done with this nonsense. No Kampala. Because there was no dancer, weirdly enough. Could be something interesting back here. Why not? Sometimes it's crates uh, with items in them. Look at that. Look at that. Vindication. Well, try to maximize what we were able to obtain from there, but it was an absolute disaster. Damn it. We're experimenting. We're experimenting. We have a jetpack. This one fine looking ghost. But I really want to find out what the split ghosts look like. When you take pictures of them. So we're going to stay here and probably die. Oh, a smiling lady. And a sad lady. Oh, she's so sad. And they're all going to split. Actually, once you have the camera, they're not that big a deal because you just keep them in place, right? Uh, so this could be a way to get around ghosting if you just carry a camera forever. Seems like a bad way of, of conducting business, honestly. Do they split still, even though they've been frozen in place? Probably it's time-based. I really need to keep track of. Yep, yep. All right, what you got? <laughs> oh, no! No! Wow, this is so fast! It's so fast. But I do like... Just leave it right here. This was just a, a journey of discovery. How about that? It was an awful... Uh, an awful I'm just gonna do it again an awful episode that we can memory hold forever but I didn't want to leave without finding out just how the new ghosts look like uh, that spirit lady intimidating spirit of the caves the absolute most evil creature Probably the most dangerous creature in Spelunky 2. The spirit of the haunted caves. Kind of fella. I would like to keep your things. I would like to have them. But, uh... I keep saying. I want to kill you for they're not that valuable, are they? They're not that valuable. Just leave them be. <laughs> that was a terribly violent interaction with this turkey. Anyway, a couple uh, turkeys over here. Totally worth the bump. To get some extra health. You got wrecked. Moron. There's another turkey right there. I mean... Oh my goodness, you're the biggest idiot. Um, would love... To kill Antonio Banderas for his extra, extra turkey. Wish he would sell you the turkey. I mean, obviously, never would buy it. Regardless, there's a Kali out there as well. How did I miss that earlier? This changes everything. Look, my guy that commits 
do all kinds of murder. Just do something like this. Absolutely disgusting. I will never stop being disgusted by how easy that is. Goes to show that I have certain cravings that just cannot be held back for long. You may think, Blargo, weren't you uh, trying to remedy your ways and maybe not resort to violence all the time? Look, it's not my fault. It's their dumbass fault. Because they insist. They insist on giving you such great rewards for the low, low, low price of inflicting the ultimate pain upon their heads. And I feel no guilt whatsoever. Uh, the guy was sacrificed. I mean, now that we have, I would rather just make a roast instead of make a rump roast. Instead of sacrificing their pathetic lowly flesh. Because turkeys are super low value. Hey, we can find the secret entrance to, to that shop. We can actually get some good stuff out of that. The problem is, we are very close to ghost time. So let's just go. Maybe that teleported pack will be worth considering. And now nah, the power pack is so much more fun. I mean, not more fun, but it's super useful. It's a good time. 1-3. All right. We don't even have the Ojadai. We don't even care. We don't care. I mean, unless it's super easy to obtain here. Another Kelly out there, though. It's gonna happen. Trepanator. Annoying to get to you. No sticky bombs. I'm trying to figure out, can I just not spend this rope? The answer is no! I must rope myself. Oh boy. That's right. Giant super explosions. Man, that's violent. Just right up my alley. Very happy to get these spring shoes. Uh, give me a key. An easy to access key, please. That would be so great. So I don't have to <laughs> I don't have to work at it. Why are you always having me work? I am fine just going without it. Oh, there it is. I think that counts as easy to access. Uh just yeah, yeah, yeah. Just be alerted. Can he get up here? I think the answer is always yes, right? It's like it used to be you could somewhat predict. Man, it's kind of difficult to get this kid where it needs to be. To the point I'm like, whatever. Just leave. <laughs> we'll just get the hell out of here. Don't care. Like I said, wanna maybe get back to that fable fight called Olmec. We go to Volcana, sure. I do have spike shoes. I can kill this guy without destroying. Well, never mind. He just killed himself like a total moron. Um, I don't even want to go through the cave. I, save me the time of going through the cave. Look at me being super lazy. Get back to Olmec. Maybe, you know, have a good time in the weird coral area. Let's go. Could have totally killed me there. If we make it there, he's just so sad. Okay, uh, Kronk gr immediately committed suicide because he knows. He knows my intention. He knows I'm like, you son of a bitch. You just want to say, look at me. Like, that was not me. That was not me going, I have the power pack so I can shoot from a chain if I feel like it. No, that was just me doing what I always did for seven years. And now it's different. Man, I wish I had a key to enter this uh, this door. Unfortunately, I just can't find the key anywhere, so I can't open that door. Uh, it's too bad, right? It's too damn bad. I wish I had what, uh, a key that could open that. I guess I'll just move on. That crushes, indeed. Uh, you might actually want to use that. Just to get through. Very useful. Look at that. Probably an intended use for those. That can be a problem. Hey! <laughs> well, that can be a problem. In fact, I think I want to do something like that. 
just to get him rolling. <laughs> the caveman was carrying the bomb. What a diligent little fellow. He's like, I can help. Let me just grab this for you. <laughs> you drop this, sir, friend. Would you like to play with the kaboom, boom, boom, boom? All right. Let's get out of here. Man, too bad I couldn't find that key to get into that secret door, huh? Uh, let's see if we can get through this without burning to a crisp. I did never found, or I was never capable. Yes! <laughs> Miscalculated that jump slightly. Would have been very bad. Man, what a nightmare to get through here. Give me a better way to go down. Maybe this way is an easier way down. There is a stump here that we can use. Well, there was a stump that we could use. No, I... <sighs> of all the ways to die, I am happy we died this way. Because boy, can I finally take responsibility off my shoulders. If there is one death in Spelunky 2 that was... 99.97% not my fault was this death and I don't claim any responsibility for what just transpired. Hopefully you had a good time and I'll see you in the next one.